1-800-291-0104, connecting to ESX server. The VI client is the primary interface for managing all aspects of the virtual infrastructure environment and provides access directly to an ESX server so it can be configured and its virtual machines can be managed. The VI client is also used to access virtual center and allows configuration of the ESX servers and management of its virtual machines. So the first thing we are going to need to do is download and install that client. To do that, we can just open up a web browser and type in the IP address of your ESX server. Mine is 192.168.0.10. From here, you can download the VMware infrastructure client, which is what we want to do. You can also download the quick start guide if you'd like. I'm going to click on Download the Infrastructure Client, and I'm just going to run it from here. If you'd like, you could save it to a share, for example, so other people can install it from the share. I'll click Run to launch the installer. And this brings up the Virtual Infrastructure Client splash screen. I'll just click Next. I'll accept the terms and the license agreement. Click Next. Enter in your username and organization. Click Next. Here you can specify where you'd like the installation files to be put. I'm just going to keep it at the default and click Next and click Install. And the installation just takes a second. The installation is complete, so I'll click Finish. And I'll just close the web browser, and you can see that there's now a shortcut on my desktop for the VMware Infrastructure Client. And I'll just double-click on it to launch it. You can also launch it from the Start menu if you'd like. And in the next movie, we'll take a look at connecting to our ESX server.